So in this project, we're going to use Core ML uh, to create a little image classifier. So you can see here that um, when I select the uh, button, it brings up my image picker. I can then view my image um, and it'll give it a little bit of classification. So the first thing we need to do is create a new project. So I've got a file, new project. I'm going to select uh, a new app or a single view application if you're not using Xcode 11 yet. Click next. I'm going to give my project a name. Let's call it ML Demo. Uh, make sure it has my unique identifier as well. I'm going to be creating a storyboard app, I'm not using Swift UI. So make sure it's click storyboard. Uh, we're using UI app delegate, and of course the language is Swift, not Objective C. And we don't need any of those core data or, or uh, included tests for this project. So click next, uh, put it into a meaningful position. Actually, you can find it later on when you need to submit your project. And then we have our new project. So the first thing we're going to do is to add in uh, the different objects which we need. So I need an image view. I'll drag onto my storyboard and make it a little bit bigger. Now, whenever I create projects, um, I tend to like to make it with the new uh, iPhone SE2 just because it has that home button when it loads up into uh, the simulator. So I'll just make this uh, image view a little bit smaller. Okay, good. Uh, now I'm also going to add in the text view. Uh, it's going to have a little bit more text than normal, so text view allows for that space. Delete the text. Some little dots in there just so I know where it is. I'm also going to add in a button. Okay, I'm going to change my button to have a camera icon. Uh, so let's go to the image tab there and I can choose that and make sure it's large. Um, you don't need to do this, you can just have it say camera if you like, um, but just gives you a little identification of what it's going to be doing. Once we've done this we need to go to our assistant editor so we can start to create the outlets and actions ready for the project to begin. So as you've done before, just give myself a bit of room, uh, you're going to con uh, press control and drag over to your code. I'm going to create an outlet for this one and this is going to be called image view with a capital V. I give myself some space. I'm going to create my text field. Again create another outlet. It's going to be called txt output. This button so it's not sitting there, and again, control and drag. Look for an action for this one, uh, and this will be BTN camera. Okay, so now I have my outlet set up and my little project, and we begin to start our uh, image pickup. 